Good evening. Welcome to the BBC News at 6. Unemployment has fallen and now stands at 2.47 million. A record number of people, nearly 8 million, are now doing part-time jobs. Many of them are women who have chosen to work fewer hours, but others have been forced into it by a shortage of full-time work. So has the recession changed the way we work? Our economics editor, Stephanie Flanders, has the details. Today's figures paint a brighter picture of the UK jobs market, probably the brightest since the recovery began. They show unemployment down by 34,000 to a total of 2.47 million. And the number of people in work rose by 160,000 in the three months to May, the biggest rise in nearly four years. But there are many in work, like Will Huckle, who's not managed to get a full-time job since he left university two years ago. He's one of the record number of people working part-time. Well, I'm working part-time in a cafe at the moment, but it's not really what I want to be doing long-term. So I've decided um, to, to really plug away at getting, getting something which I studied in. Many part-time workers, especially women, don't want full-time work. But the number of full-time jobs is falling and wages aren't keeping pace with inflation. A lot of the increase was due to, to part-time work rather than full-time work. 